Rebecca fans. So I know it's Saturday and I shouldn't be up, but you know. I'm just a super motivated person. I was up most of the night Facebook stalking under the guise of, wait for it, Tucker in my pants. Clever, I know. And I sent friend requests to everyone in the office. Almost everyone is accepted, except for Nat, of course. She's hit that 5,000 person limit. So we'll just kind of wait and see. But holy shit, you guys. Wait until you see what I found out. You guys, someone in the office has a kid. And you will never guess who. And no, it's not me. Good morning, Atlanta. It's a beautiful Saturday. Today will be a pleasant 78 degrees, and later yeah. in the afternoon, it'll get cooler at around 4 p.m. It's time to unwind in this gorgeous weather. Did anyone watch the presidential debate? It looks like Michelle Obama is going to win in the upcoming election. The ladies need this after an awful eight years of Trump. That's your morning wake up. Here's a great new track to get you moving. <laughs> it's you. Uh, hey, Tasha. What are you doing here? Uh, playing ball. Oh, must be nice. Yeah, I guess just another typical Saturday. See, I would have thought you'd been off with your friends celebrating with all the money that you're getting for leaking our information to Wolf. What are you talking about? Mia told me about the new Bow City campaign, their new Bradford lookalike. We just discussed I swear this. Swear to God, that wasn't me. I had no idea. Yeah, I'm supposed to believe that, right? Daddy, Daddy, you're supposed to throw the ball back. Ew. Typical woman. Come on. So you're hmm, part of the Big Brother program. No, this is my kid, Riley. Pleasure to meet you. <laughs> yeah, OK, look, we'll just talk about this later, right? Uh, I think we need to go that way, too. You want to go to the swings? Yeah. There is no way that he has time to raise a child and work a full-time job. And I can't wait to tell Nat on Monday because she hates children. Like, if kids were puppies, she would be Cruella de Vil. She would skin them and sew them together and make a coat and wear it around the office. If it was Nat in a room with a child and that child was on fire and she had a glass of water, she would ask for a lemon and then she would drink it. He's getting fired. And I'm definitely getting a promotion for this. Rebecca! Okay guys, yes, I still live with my mother, but it's not because I can't afford my own place. It's because she really needs me here to take care Rebecca, of her. Rebecca! Rebecca! Mom! I have told you for the hundredth time, do not interrupt me when I'm vlogging! But you told me to tell you when your Mickey Mouse pancakes are ready. Oh. Oh, Mickey. Hey, uh, I think we still need to uh, talk about that bow tie account. In front of that? Oh, she, she's not. How how old is it? Uh, she is seven. Seven, eleven, Kevin, Devin. Zach, I'm sorry. I, I didn't even know you were married. I'm not. Oh. That's okay. You know, I don't talk much about it at work. You know, her mother and I separated a couple years ago, and she became a big executive and decided she didn't want to have anything to do with us anymore. Oh, that sucks. Yeah, you know, women these days, they just don't want to take responsibility for their kids. Daddy says not to grow up like the woman at work. Is that you? <laughs> I guess she pays a little better attention than I thought. Hey, look, swings! Yay! So how do you manage to work, find time for her? I mean, like, how do you do that? Easy. Just don't sleep. Hmm. What are you doing? Get out of here, you purr! Makes sense. If it wasn't you who leaked the information, who was it? I think I know.
So you'd think child support in this environment would be more male friendly, but it's not, it's worse. Uh, the judge will listen to you, make your case, but it's still gonna go uh, the lady's way either way. This lady owed me thousands, tens of thousands of dollars in back child support. In some kind of way, my check gets garnished. I guess what goes around comes around.